So in this video, I want to go over three reasons why the New York Yankees will win the 2023 MLB World Series Championship this season uh, and be crowned 2023 MLB World Series Champions. Now, as always, this is just my opinion. Your opinion may be completely different. That is 100% okay. I'll just leave your thoughts and opinions down below in the comment section of this video. Let's get right into it. So reason number one is that the New York Yankees might have the best rotation in all of baseball or at the very least, um, one of the most stacked rotations um, in all of baseball. Uh, the New York Yankees made a pretty big splash this offseason, uh, signing Carlos Rodon, who was the best pitcher available on the market, um, besides guys like Justin Verlander um, and, and Jacob deGrom, of course. But um, other than that, you know, one of the best pitchers in all of baseball in 2022 uh, was in the National League Young Conversation uh, and overall a tremendous addition uh, to an already stacked rotation. So as it stands right now, um, the projected rotation is Garrett Cole, Carlos Rodon, Luis Severino, and Nestor Cortez. That's their top four. That is stacked. That is arguably the best one through four rotation in all of baseball. It drops off a little bit with their number five. Um, one healthy, it's probably going to be Frankie Montez. Could they add an arm to their team? Absolutely. But as of right now, um, they're one through four with Cole, Rodon, Severino, Cortez. A nice blend of righty-lefty. Um, all players that are in the prime of their careers. Gary Cole's a little bit up there in age, I guess, 32 years old. But um, regardless, still some of the best pitchers in all of baseball. Um, you can make the argument that one through four, these are the best one through four in all of baseball. Um, and the Yankees having these guys you know, going out there if they are healthy. Um, on, on you know on an everyday basis, it's going to be one of the hardest teams to face in all of baseball from a starting pitching perspective. Uh, and you know the Yankees have the most stack rotation in all of baseball, in my opinion, uh, in pitching, especially come playoff time when the rotation is a little bit smaller and you're running a three-man, four-man rotation. Uh, these four guys are going to be studs, and you're only going to go as far as these guys can take you. So. I think one of the reasons why the Yankees can be a championship team in 2023 um, is the starting rotation is stacked, and it's arguably one of the best in all of baseball, so that's reason number one. So reason number two is the fact that they brought back Aaron Judge and they have him locked up to a long-term contract. Aaron Judge last year was the best player in all of baseball. Uh, put up records for home runs. You know, I think he had 62 home runs, which beats Roger Maris's record. Um, incredible. Is he going to get that again in 2023? I mean, statistically, I would say probably not, but um, even if Aaron Judge is a 45 home run guy, a 40 home run guy, he's still one of the best players in all of baseball, one of the best power hitters in all of baseball, and he's extremely valuable to this team. Um, if the Yankees were to, have, were to have lost Aaron Judge this offseason, that would have been a tough, uh, tough position to replace. So Aaron Judge uh, really carries the load offensively for this Yankees team. And just the fact that he's back on a long-term contract, um, no more question marks, no more distractions. Um, Aaron Judge can just simply go out there and play baseball. We're not asking him to hit 60, you know, two home runs again per se. That'd be great. But if Aaron Judge can be a 45 home run guy, a 40 home run guy, um, he's still going to bring a lot of value to this team and he's going to carry the load offensively. So um, for a roster that didn't really gain a lot of other players outside of bringing back Aaron Judge um, and Anthony Rizzo offensively, they're really going to be relying upon Aaron Judge to carry the load um, offensively once again in 2023 and have an MVP caliber type of season. So uh, by bringing back the best player in baseball in 2022, um, Aaron Judge is really going to help this Yankees team compete for a World Series in 2023 this season. Now, the last reason is more of a projection, more of a speculation, more of an assumption, rather than what they can do right now to win a World Series. And that's the Yankees can make a big trade, and they're going to be making a big trade either prior to the start of the season or during the 2023 MLB season. I would put a lot of uh, you know emphasis on the Yankees going down that route. Um, this offseason. Now, uh, we've seen someone like Brian Reynolds linked to the Yankees in the past as maybe their new left fielder target. Um, I think some other names could become available throughout the season, maybe Shoei Otani, for example. So uh, I would keep an eye on the Yankees making a big trade or a big splash this offseason. Maybe it carries over into the season, whatever the case may be. But I do think the Yankees are going to add another big time bat to this lineup. Uh, and if that is Brian Reynolds of the Pittsburgh Pirates, that would be a huge addition. If it is Shoei Otani of the Los Angeles Angels, that would be a ginormous addition. I really do think the Yankees are going to make a big trade this offseason uh, or in the 2023 MLB season. Uh, and it's going to be a trade that pushes them over the edge in regards to a championship team. Uh, and, we'll like, and, and we'll make this team win a World Series in 2023. I will guarantee that. So just leave your thoughts down below in the comment section of this video. These are three reasons why the New York Yankees will win the 2023 MLB World Series championship this season. Have a great rest of your day. Thanks again for watching and see you in the next one.